Hi, this is Charles Castor, and I have got Abby with me today. And Abby is a mother of four. She has been a wife for 28 years, married to Rob, wonderful dude. Um, Abby runs multiple businesses. I don't mean like just one or two, but she runs multiple businesses. And when I first met Abby, I don't know, about two years ago, she didn't feel very well at all. She had all kinds of situations going on. Did you not, Abby? And she wasn't happy like the way she felt. And she also was not happy with the way she looks. And, you know, Abby, going back to that time, you know, uh, we chatted a bit. And so, you know, let, let people know where you were before that situation. Like, what were you going through at that time? And how was your life at that point? <laughs> Well, Chuck, it was two years ago, and I can't believe it, but um, when I first met you, I had just returned from a beautiful vacation where nobody wanted their pictures taken because we all felt blah. <laughs> I was the heaviest I had ever been, at weighing in at 208 pounds, feeling very old, and I was 49 years old at the time thinking, I don't want to go into my 50s looking and feeling this bad. I was tired, I was depressed, and I knew I had to make a change. I just didn't know what to do. Okay, well I knew, I know that it took you like eight months, maybe, eight months, something like that, but I know you didn't buy into any of this. You know, it, it did not resonate with you, I think, when you first saw it. So tell us what concerns you had about this program and what you realized as you went through it. Chuck, I am like the biggest skeptic and because I've tried so many things in the past and nothing worked because I had to either count calories or grams or do, you know, keep journals and apps. And I'm just too busy for that. I'm going to tell you straight out. I am not able to keep track of anything because I'm so busy. I'm a mom of four. Who has time for that? So um, it was really tough for me to believe that a program would work for me. Okay, so do you believe? <laughs> uh, the proof is in the, uh, the better picture <laughs> that you have of me. Um, dropped four dress sizes in two months. And people noticed. And I felt amazing. I had energy, mental clarity, focus. Um, my husband wanted to, wanted to know what happened to his wife because I was a different person. I passed up creme brulee. That's how different I, <laughs> I never passed up creme brulee. Well, so what did you drop from and to your max I weight? Dropped from, I dropped from uh, 208 to 155 in five months. And we went on, um, for my 50th birthday, we went to Hawaii and I was able to hike without getting short of breath. I have some health issues that, uh, you know, didn't allow me to do some of the things that I wanted to do. And this, you know, dropping the weight and having the energy to hike was an incredible, it was an, a very incredible experience for me. It's awesome. So do you, this is something you could do the rest of your life. Like right now, it's been quite a bit of time since you went through this. So where is your weight right now? Because that's always the key. Everybody's always like, oh, I lost this weight. And then it's like, oh my gosh, I put on 50 pounds. Mm -hmm. So where are you right now? What I love is that I um, have lost that weight and have kept it off for close to two years. <laughs> Um, I can eat the foods that I love. There's no restrictions there. You know, if I want to have pineapple, I'll eat it. I love that, um, you know, it's very simple and sustainable, and it's a lifestyle that I can do forever, I, and I will. So the eight months, you were, are you mad at yourself? You took eight months to make a decision? I could kick myself. Okay, yeah, <laughs> that, was, that was a long eight months. <laughs> it was. And, uh, you know, and I just love the fact that I can share the results with my family and friends and um, help them as well. So what were the couple of things you liked the most about this entire program that, that you maybe didn't believe at first, but what, what did you notice the biggest benefits were from what areas of it? Well, I, I needed accountability. Um, you know, I would do things in the past, lose a little, but I love the fact that we have a community that keeps me accountable. And if I have questions, I can turn to you or other people in the community to help keep me accountable and on the right path. 
And if you decided to eat the creme brulee, you know you can and you know how to Absolutely. do that. Absolutely. Awesome. Um, yeah. I used to eat it like all the time and I, I've cut way back, but I, you know, it's, it's something that I can have when I want it. I just don't have the cravings like I used to. That's awesome. Well, Abby, it's been a pleasure meeting you, even though the first beginning portion was a little bit rocky. Um, and I just, I love what uh, has gone on with you and how you show up for your family in a different way right now, because you have to, because you got a lot going on. So I appreciate you taking the time today. Anything else you want to share at all? Um, just that, that I'm very grateful for you and your family has been a great help for me as well. And uh, I thank God every day for you. Well, th we do too for you too, because we've been kind of become close in this whole thing. So I really appreciate you too. And my wife appreciates you. So Abby, thank you very much and have thank a great you. day. You See too. You.